All right, here I am with Lowrider, December 97. I just want to give huge thanks to all the people that have subscribed over the past few months or and even since the beginning. It feels fantastic to see that there's people that want to see this and want to support just by subscribing. It feels really good on my end. And I just want to say thanks. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting. I love reading the comments. And it's always really fun to engage back and forth. But without fur further ado, let's get into it. December. We got a crazy ass ad for selling this, the stereo thing for your car. I just don't know who that guy is, man. He just look, he's just looking a little twacked out. Anyways, here we got the first um, the first table of contents, and it looks pretty pretty sexy to me so far. We got Daza. Um, if you want to subscribe to her fan base, cool little ads, everything low. I like how all the advertisements in here are like lowrider oriented. Like this, Reds Hydraulics, the wheels, and now we got our first articles, Cruising Through a Jaguar Fantasy. Santa Fe students use lowriders and Aztec Arte to cherry out Capitol High School. That's really cool for your high school to come out in lowrider magazine. I wonder if that mural still exists at that high school. And then on the right side you got Merry Christmas from, I don't know, Beto Salazar, Los Bajitos de Grand Prairie, Texas. Then we got Blood on the Border, nearly 1,200 perished in three years crossing the U.S.-Mexican border. Man, I wonder how many more have have died cr tried crossing in these past few years it's been a deadly time robert seuss claus bidding farewell to a people's low writer rest in peace and then here we have the latino comedian of the year lincoln heights rudy moreno leaves him laughing i'm gonna have to check him out rudy moreno huh the money pit nobody said building a 64 super sport was gonna be cheap <laughs> Maybe they didn't say it was going to be cheap, but it's looking damn sexy, man. Orange lowriders, it's always like an electric feeling just to see the the bright orange. And, uh, yeah, the interior, white and orange. Man, I love that creamy um, color, color pattern. The batteries, all the stuff on the inside. I wonder how many batteries it takes to operate the the hydraulic systems. Super nice, dude. Super nice look. The lowrider model looks really pretty. I can't find her name. Oh, Lilia Rangel or Rangel. Super nice, super cute. And here we have Rocky Kinslow, 64 Chevy Impala Super Sport from Signal Hill Ultimate Versions Car Club really cool then we got fat and fatter sumo wrestling with menace pants or these are either really long shorts or really short pants clothing with attitude the sexy wheels uh-huh back to fort worth texas i think i've been here before only through only through lowrider magazine though we have juan Juan's full show Ford Mustang for the likes of Miss Daza. Daza spotted. There you go. Since the beginning. The Miller Light girls. Hell yeah. And they're like outfits. You know, the crowd. Man, dude. Seeing something like this just blows me away every time. Armando Hernandez has no trouble placing first. Fuck, dude. Everything crawled out. How is that even possible? You got pop singer Angelina. Kit Frost. 
the winner for BF Goodrich, Steven Sanchez and his son. Some more models. I think I've seen this crazy ride before. Greg Armentos, 89, Beretta. This one up here is crazy. Then you got the sponsors, Valvoline, Dayton Wire Wheels, the Miller Light advertisements from Milwaukee. More Fort Worth. Latin Image Bike Club. Caliente Car Club. Del Valle. Phalanx. Phalanx Car Club. Los Royal Classics. Aztec Image. The BF Goodrich. And Sears Tire Booth. And all the other trophy winners. I love this advertisement for Valvoline, dude. I like how it's in Spanish, too. They know who, they know who their target audience is. You have Catalina. So there's a few artists I don't know. Catalina, Angelina. You have Introducing Chubb, Alva, Brennan, Eric from Sulphur Springs. Fort Worth, a little bit more pictures. What is this? A, a signing? The Thump Records booth was happening. That's pretty cool. This picture up here is really cool too. Hub and Dance competition. Man, this is a really cool um, spread. You got cars like going like down, then you got that. you have them going up. That's really cool to have them like on the side. And of course, you have the ones just going really fast. But I really like the, the Geo Tractors or the Suzuki's. That's a, yeah, this whole, all these pages are really cool. Lowrider Magazine's Project Honda. What? Our Suave Civic is ready to roll. What do you mean? One of the most popular car Marques used for Euro Lows is the Honda Civic. So when BF Goodrich rolled out its new H-rated Euro TA line of radials designed specifically for the lowrider market. It seemed only natural that we do a Project Honda to showcase the tires in their ad and many other custom bolt-on Euro products. That's pretty cool. The lowrider magazine team worked on building a car and it came out looking sexy. The model's name is Jennifer Flores. Very nice. A little bit more information on the Project Honda. Owner, a lower, low rider magazine, 97 Honda Civic hatchback from Walnut, California. No affiliation to no car club. Teaching you how to do maintenance to avoid burning down your car. FB County, roll on the best. Cracker Dog's Caprice? What do you mean Cracker Dog? It's the homie Cracker Dog. The guy's called Sam Judah, a 90 Chevrolet Caprice from Jacksonville, Florida. New Movement Car Club. Yep, it looks pretty, looks pretty gangster, man. The Caprice, not too familiar with them, but they kind of look like a Cadillac. But I'm not sure if these ones are the same size or maybe a little bit smaller. I know the Cadillac the Cadillacs are freaking huge. And everything in here is red. Pretty pretty clean. Nothing too crazy. Then you have take it to the limits. What that's a really cool picture for the lowrider bike. Really crazy designs. You know, you have the whole thing. The frame of the bike covering the wheel, but with some crazy designs where the wheel, where the wheel comes out on. Got the little alien guy with all those crazy um, pinstriping designs. 
man, that looks complicated to do. They're just coming in and out, layering over each other. The chain, that's really cool how it goes behind the thing. And the dude también, just the way he's dressed. Really cool. Really telling of the time. Spage Age Cruiser. It even looks good in, in black and white. Man, if it looks good in black and white, it looks really good in person. Or in color. I mean, right here, he has like a... The Looney Tunes Space Guy. Right there, también a little muñeco. Really cool. Freddy Velasquez, Out of This World, the Pedal Scraper. That's really cool, man. But we shall move on. Sir Bass. In days of old, when knights were bold and boom, and boom boxes weren't invented, all they had were, all they had were minstrel bands, and no one was contented. <laughs> what? This is a really cool interior. Got the switches right there. The sounds, the sound systems off. Off the hook, man. Off the hook. And I wonder um, how it sounds going down the street. If these are the fools that are like tearing down, tearing down the streets. Then you got the Predator. Melvin Murray's super sharp Chevy S10 is playing quite well in Peoria. Again, fat ass, like long ass truck. Crazy ass designs, two different colors. Yeah, just um, it's pretty pretty wicked. This is pretty cool. They both had really cool tires. The Sir Bass has a really cool picture with his hyena, Paul M. Dominguez Jr. eighty six Chevy S ten Blazer from Delano. Then you have the Predator, Melvin Murray, 83 Chevy S10 from Peoria, Illinois, Royal Individuals Car Club. Then the 97 Nopi Nationals. Where is the Nopi Nationals? Is that a place? A place I've never heard of, only in magazines. Once again, it was Showtime in Atlanta. Ah, Georgia, Atlanta. Man, you got the sexy women's with the nice ass rides. Got the crazy ass rides. This freaking truck has two, four, six, eight wheels. And then you have more crazy rides. Got the couples. You got the lowrider classics. Joe Salazar won best lowrider. Is this one the one called Las Vegas? I don't know, but I know for a fact I've seen this one before. You have, um, of course, Aztec One was parked on the main cruising area. Yeah, it looks like a really bomb, bomb place to do a lowrider show. Got the kids. You got. Stanton Hobby Shop from Chicago, Illinois. I'm assuming, oh yeah, the car, the car models. You got the vans doing, doing the tricks. You got Harold, Erica, Goldie, Hetcher, and Lillian from Orlando, Florida. Best custom boys. Los Boys from Illinois. And that's a pretty sick ass picture. There's more pictures of people. A couple of um, car dancing. The Nopi Hoppers. That's a really cool um, page, man. Got the freaking Suzuki's being lifted off the ground. And the hopping contests. And that's really cool. This fool has Tonka on the side of his truck. Here we go, a big boy's 48. A Fat Fender 48 with everything on it. Damn, dude, this is a really nice truck. I really like it. Silver everything. I like it when they put on the bed of the truck, like the wood. 
and the wood flooring también on the bed, the spare tires. Man, just a classic car. A little bit more information, owner, Thomas Cervantes Jr., 48 Chevy. 48 Chevy Thrift Master Pickup from Compton Classic Memories Car Club. Man, dude, that's a classic ass car. We have Dad's 57, a 57 Chevy with generations of pride and passion. Man, it is crazy. This is like 50s style, but it looks like new age just because it's like you already know it's pimped out to the lowrider standards. The interior is all, you know, out of this world. And this was like straight up gangster. But the car's from the 50s and they're in the 90s. Something from the 50s with a 90s gangster twist. Then here we have... I don't, I don't even know what that word is. Crypt Keeper. Crypt Keeper. The guy that keeps all the, the crypts. Oh yeah, right there. All the books, I, I'm assuming. That's a tough looking skull, man. It's a tough looking skull. But apart from the mural, man, that's a fat ass car, dude. Huge ass car. The interior, purple plush. Zuki's custom Cadillac is cruising the coast and keeping it cool. Freaking Cadillacs, man. They're huge. Humongous. What? Jordan Sportswear? <laughs> Look at his pants. So is this just for shirts or did, do they do pants as well? Man, those are some fat ass pants. I still have yet to see someone dressed like this with these kind of pants next to their lowrider. But the Dad's 57 is from Paul Vega, 57 Chevy Bel Air, La Puente, California, Elite Car Club. Then you have Crypt Keeper, Zuki Duvo. 81 Cadillac Coupe de Ville from Brenton, Florida. Lowrider Times. It's really cool. Where's the Lowrider of the Month? That's what I want to know. Beyond your imagination. Okay, here we go. I think this is Lowrider of the Month right here. Wait, before we get to there, the lettering on the Gangster. That's really cool. A new company called Gangster Wire Wheels. Or to the and the Gangster Wire Wheels has a ground cover no matter how low you ride. That's pretty sick, man. I think this is the first time I see an advertisement for Gangster Wire Wheels. Where did they come from? But then here we go. The creator. What? This is the ride of the month. I can tell. Abel Diaz is truly inspirational tradition. Crazy ass, you got the geometric um, square designs, the ribbon going all the way around it. You got the biblical depictions. And I think I've seen this right before when like on a smaller piece, when it was like the size of a little thumbnail, because I remember seeing the, the cross. That's really cool, man. I can't really tell all the other murals, but I know, you know, they're really well done. I like how they're all kind of the same color, color coded with like oranges and reds, making it look really warm, matching with the whole car as well. That's really nice. In 85 Buick Riviera, the creator. Damn, dude, and the front looks amazing I think the windows are tinted as well on with like a yellow um, tint man that's really cool and then the girl's name is Miriam Varela super nice as well man man that's what I'm saying man you got Lucifer on the back um, I can't really tell what these other depictions are. But here we go. The centerfold. Boom. Damn, dude. That's freaking.
This is really hot and sexy. Abel Diaz of Elgin, Illinois. You got um, the mother holding Jesus Christ as he's already dead. Um, the girl in her Budweiser dress. Crazy. The wheels. Gold. Man. And right here, they just have pictures of like the interior. I have no idea what the engine. And then I think this is like the under part of it. The back behind the seats, you have this. What the hell is even going on? This is like some Star Wars type sci-fi fantasy, man. Damn, this car goes hard. This is one of the hardest lowriders of the month, man. I don't know how the rest of the magazine is going to go after this. I guess this was the climax of the magazine. From Latin American Car Club. <coughs> Sorry. Super cool. Then you have interviews with people. Lowrider Magazine publisher talks about the sale of Lowrider Magazine. Oh, I'm going to come back to this, dude. I've always wanted to know about this. I want to know. Shoot. <laughs> I want to know how many like units of each magazine they produced every month because fools have this all over the world hitting the wall and upset and I think that's it well this time they put the loader of the month towards the end of the magazine no mi sueño to dream is to do for this heavy Chevy owner damn dude fat ass truck got a black pink silver i love this dude i love the front i think the lights are behind the grill i wonder how it looks when he turns on the the headlights the inside is like all pastel colors super nice my dream tony alvarez 92 chevy silverado from san diego slammed illusions car club that's a sick ass name then the bag looks really nice really clean española now what a show that was hotter than hatch green chiles you got angel martinez hangs out with one of the intrigues car club's finest cars you got the whole family out here Got the homies from Española's prestigious few. Michelle poses with TJ's 91 Nissan from Intrigues Car Club. Crazy checkered pattern designs, man. And this chick up here with her hair looks really cool. Dignity Car Club came in from Albuquerque. Damn. Scandalous times. Look at that girl's hair. Rose and Sylvia like what they see. Damn. Scandalous times. Española Valley. We got more bi biblical depictions on the murals. This fool has like 20 trophies right there. One hell of a time. Española Super Show. That's a sick ass picture. All the people posing with the banner. The homie with his bike. That's really cool. And then you have Miami Super Show. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sunday, January 18, 1998. Damn, dude. I wonder if I have that one. You got more pictures of food with his trike. Some two more lovely ladies. Alicia and Camila keeping it real. Fat ass crowd. Oh, no way. See me glow. What? This one's a really sexy ass car too. Man, the interior. I love how they just went with like, I don't know what, I don't even know dude. Like just, um, I don't even know what material this is, but 
you know just straight simple nothing too crazy on the dashboards or on the inside of the doors you know because sometimes people make it up put drapes and everything candy paint that's so thin to see you can hardly even see it when you're like this far away the designs on this car are freaking crazy the color you know yellow gold it's such dude the car is just pure eye candy the wheels are freaking sick too what the headlights are blacked out that's sick dude i don't think i've ever seen that that's super nice then here you have raquel maldonado as the as a beautiful lady posing for the car damn you have the whole team there owner adrian pimentel 92 hyundai's hyundai's scope from santa ana california illustrious car club what one of the of these it, i wonder if these guys still have it though has this car survived the test of time the project honda the videos that'd be really cool to have i think i've seen some on youtube no way bombastic 52 sick ass name the bottles right there keeping up the tradition damn fine ass Heine too called l a r y n a larina larina Larin, larina god damn can't say it owner jose ruiz 52 chevrolet deluxe ontario tradition car club from coming in from the ie damn sexy ass ride man enough said the dashboard damn that looks crazy that's really sick dude and then here we have reds man i'm starting to like the reds um, advertisements more and more life is a jam go play what <laughs> that's so cool you have the freaking sparks flying out of the car from scraping you have um the couple right here dressed all cool wearing their reds um attire the jacket the baseball shirt man that's really cool another one overtime damn this was been putting up too much work many an extra hour was worked for this east la cutlass damn fuck the back looks freaking amazing <laughs> together <laughs> this, man, that's really cool man the interior this one has everything just like um how do people feel when they enter this car do they like take off their shoes and put their shoes in the bag do they gotta clean their shoes before they come in um because it's clean dude or do they put a mat over it do, do they put a mat over it so they don't get it dirty because that's what i'm thinking now got the gold little sliver on top that's really nice you got a gold little middle piece to combine with that really nice touch i like how you got little hints of silver everywhere but the car's overall blue the model looks really nice i can't find her name okay her name's christina lucero shout out to her that's a sick ass picture with the whole family old school just look at this fool's socks why does this fool have socks that the high his why are his socks higher than his dad's socks and then um the mom isn't smiling she ain't even happy she got like five kids i'm assuming they got the sun in their eyes but damn dude sick ass family picture 79 oldsmobile cutlass charles chas herrera from pico rivera from together car club damn nice ass picture of the whole family and then you have speaking of families a royal family affair this mural right here dude azteca woman her leg coming out 
feathers going all the way around, kind of reminiscent of the Virgen de Guadalupe kind of um, design. Um, you have the Royal Individuals Annual Car Show in Aurora, Illinois. First time hosting. What? Crazy trunks, man. That looks freaking crazy. Got the whole team. That's a huge ass trike. Then just a little bit more of Bicycle Magazine. Aurora, Illinois, huh? Members only car club. Now it's only fans. I wonder if there's an only fans car club. Oh, I, probably should, I probably cut this part out. What? Thumps Records, the party label. Really cool um, designs, I guess. Going with that Christmas theme. The Wraith and Me and My Shadow. Sick ass little Euros, an automotive operation that boggles the mind. Man, the interior on this one is crazy. I love how this was, um, the little thing opens up to reveal the lights. And it has like two little lights in there. The interior, cookies and cream. Man, both fantastic. Owner, Chris something 86 Toyota Supra what South Ozone Park from New York Jurassic Auto Car Club and then the the yellow one is a uh, Ben Arang 91 Dodge Shadow Honolulu Hawaii Lowriders Pride Car Club that's really cool the letters to Lowrider I think that might have been it I think that might have been it Lowrider Online, sick ass advertisement, the old school little window. <laughs> That's really cool. The birth of the internet. 1998 calendar, damn dude. That one must be super hot and sexy issue, man. And what is this? Um, hottest Latinas in the country. Is this another calendar? Is that Daza? No, I don't think it is. Got the Lowrider low Arte, luxury at its finest. Some really cool drawings. The mail in mailbox roll call. Sick ass kid. George and David Santos with a 93 Bonneville SST from Chicago. This is really cool too. And that's it. This magazine was way too long. Sorry, guys. The music. I love this. these ads, man. I can look at these all day. Deep House 3. Flashback Disco. Car Audio Installation School. That's pretty cool. How to. Navidad Mix. What? Mezcla contigo, Presidente? That's hard. That goes really hard, man. Sick ass advertisement. Lowrider. Man, what a way to end the year. How many pages did this have? Like 190. 6, 9, 7, 98, 99. 202 pages. Man, what a sick ass way to end the year. I'll be back tomorrow with more Lowrider magazines, but for now, peace.